Hi, we're out here at the farm and we're, um, we'd like to know this soil here, do you have to fertilize it every year to keep it uh, healthy? Uh, actually, the uh, alfalfa, not as much. It's uh, kind of a nitrogen fixing plant, so it fixes its own nitrogen. And um, occasionally we do just from the wear and tear of cutting and baling and trying to get it to stimulate a little more growth. But uh, normally we don't do, do very much fertilizing on this. It's pretty you know, much natural. Just a moment ago, was, Margaret was speak, speaking to me regarding the lambs being out here, right? Is oh, that yes, part of the fertilization yes. too? And what, what else do those lambs do? The sheep are sheep, out here for, uh, <laughs> for kind of a, um, they'll clip everything down. It's a cleansing of the, the old growth and stuff that wasn't picked up they'll clean up everything so you don't have when you cut your alfalfa in the spring you don't pick up a lot of old growth and and how many sheep oh, do you good. have like a herd or what there was a herd uh, i have a, a sheep farmer that brings them in oh. and they um they go from farm to farm oh. and uh it's no charge. They just have a place that they can oh my Lord. feed like their... I like to videotape really them cool. next time they come out and yeah. take a look at the yeah. sheep doing. That's kind of They've been doing a great job. Look how green that is. It's yeah. beautiful. And then you got the buttes in the background here. Now, can you see uh, Shasta, Mount Shasta? Can you see Lassen from here too? Or am I just imagining things? <laughs> On a clear, clear day, you can almost get there, but... Uh, Over there, uh, there's white snow. On yeah, top of that. yeah. Over there. A lot of Thank snow. You. Well, it's yeah. a beautiful, beautiful scene. So, uh... You, you, you're going to continue with the family farm. You grow besides rice, tomatoes, corn, corn, sunflowers, sunflower. Oh, that'd be pretty. What else? For seed, they're all for seed. Um, we grow dry beans. Dry beans. We grow vine seed. Vine seed. Which is watermelons, is cucumbers, oh. squash. Uh, all well, for seed. Seed oh, production. No kidding. Okay, so seeds as, as well beyond. Well, just... whenever the stuff is becoming ripe, we'll be making stuff over here at Guinevere's. And right now, we're going to use the rice this weekend, make some Italian sushi, and we're going to also have uh, hot peppers and uh, pulled pork over their rice. So come down to Guinevere's and have some of the Mattioli rice over here. Yes. How do you pronounce that rice again? Black Fox. And you should see the logo. It's gorgeous, and the rice is delicious. Well, see you later. Aww.